This sheep looks like it's dead, and this fox is hungry. <laughs> Someone's planning to make a meal of it. I'm in Spain's Monfragüe National Park. With a black vulture in the sky and a griffin vulture on the ground, the expectation is intense. The fox makes himself scarce. Which is what the great carrion eater and the small Egyptian vulture were waiting for. Soon, more relatives join the feast. The black vulture opens a long slit along the sheep's abdomen with its powerful beak, allowing the griffin vultures to sink their long necks into the cavity and reach for the internal organs. And the guests keep arriving. There's plenty enough to go round. Enough for six? Or sixteen? Wait a minute, there's a fight, but that's to be expected. If you mess with me again, I'll... The ruckus is too much for some to take. The black vulture is the largest scavenger on the peninsula and not as fond of company as the griffin vulture. He doesn't enjoy having to fight for his food. They've had enough, or they've eaten enough, and they hop away. Only the Egyptian vulture keeps waiting, perhaps thinking, but what did they get that I didn't get? There's not much left. It's all gone. The cleaning service has done its job to perfection, and they take flight in ones and twos. It's hard to get moving again after a hearty meal. on the ground, but once in the air, they're magnificent. <laughs> <laughs>